Welcome back, survivors. Disturb Z here. And we are back in the wandering village. Ambu's sleeping right now, so he's not really wandering. What do we got here? Think quickly. Ah. Uh, yep. Go get something to pull him out. 40 water, 20 sand. Okay, so do we have. Yeah, we don't really have anything we can send people to. I mean, we can send them to that, but I really don't need any knowledge. I don't think we've really spent any, to be honest with you. How much do I have? I have 71. So yeah, I'm really not even not even in need of knowledge. We kind of got a surplus of it. I mean, I'm just kind of curious as to the next thing that's going to pop up since we can't see very far, which, of course, is because of my thick fog yeah 25% extra on that would probably show us like so much more of the map but you know that's what I chose to play with all right let's speed things up here all right so what do we got going we are at 1140 on food so we're not having food issues yet we still got plenty of that what is this grilled tomatoes okay so we've got some stuff um, do we need to add in another couple of berry pickers? Yeah, we've got some unemployed. Let's do that. Let's add in some more berry pickers because I notice our berries are quite low. So go down here, go to berry gatherer, and where is an adequate berry field? I put it right there it'd be a hundred percent I'm gonna put it right there so I'm not even gonna put a road out there to it I'm just gonna put that one there just they can walk across the grass it won't it won't hurt anything and we are going into the desert so let me pause this real fast Let's switch up our crop. We're going to corn. Corn and corn. Alright, grab that guy. Kind of hoping we'd find some more iron, maybe. We don't have a whole lot. How are we doing on housing? We are at 180 out of 178, so we're actually good there. Oh, 154. We got all three at 15. We are 10 on on uh, deco. So what decos do I not have? Is there something that's giving a negative over here? Okay, so I'm a bit confused. Isn't the... No, okay, so for some reason... Wait, where'd it go? Huh. don't get it how how are you not full I'm in six that's nine ten eleven oh because of that okay no 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 I know why I know why um would it reach if I put in one more hinge right there or hinge arch sorry Stonehenge that's what went through my head All right, send someone out for that. Okay, so... We've only got three filling on food foods. So I'm trying to figure out where my kelp is going. So I was told the other day, or on the last video, 
um, or it might have been two videos ago, Some at some point, we had like 50 something kelp and then it all disappeared, but I don't know where it could have went to because the only thing using kelp is the Anbu food, the Anbu kitchen. Uh, do this one. Water and sand. Excellent. And I don't know where else it could have went. Um, I know, I mean, I know the farm up here uses it, but like, what happens to the kelp it produces? Does it produce less kelp than than what you used to put in it? Like, you would think it would multiply. If it doesn't multiply, there's a problem. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What just what what just happened here? Is it because it's hot? Hold on. What crops don't grow at current temperatures? Oh, did it die? Maybe that's what it is. Maybe maybe it's my aqua farm killing them. You know what? I'm going to do this. I'm going to disable the aqua farm because maybe that's maybe it has such a small grow range. Maybe that's what's happening is instead of growing it, we're killing it because it maybe it only grows in like the ocean. I mean, that makes sense, but I mean on the farm, maybe we have to be in the ocean biome to actually grow it. That's literally the only thing I could think of is the farm is killing it, but I mean, we just left the ocean. We should have had, I don't know. I don't know. You would think we would have had a surplus, but I don't know. Maybe instead of a, of a farm, maybe I just put a third fishery down. Alright, so what do we got? We got mountains? Yep, I think that's what we're going to do. I think we're going to go north. What is that? That's a dune. Go ahead and send them out to that dune. Yeah, let's go to the mountains. Onbu accepts. Awesome. Send them out there to that guy, and we'll see. Maybe we can find some more mines. Alright, so where are we at? Oh, we are at 155. Nice. So we are literally 5% away from having, having it all. Okay... I'm just checking to see if we have any buildings over here that are low. It looks like everybody... Pollution minus five. Who's causing pollution? You're causing pollution. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, I mean, I guess that we really can't avoid that. That's such a huge thing, but... Yes, that's where it is. We're down here. We're losing. I mean, we've got full decoration, but we're losing it. So, yeah, I don't think we're going to... Unless I get rid of the dung collector, I don't think we're going to get any higher than that. Which I could get rid of the dung collector. I mean, if we did... Other than compost, are we really using it for anything? I mean, we're not using it for biogas, right? Where did I put... Yeah, it's up here. Wrong compost. I mean, we really haven't had to turn on the bile thing either. Maybe, maybe that's what we should do. Maybe we should just get rid of that building.
Can I build another one higher up? Like, I mean, I know it's not going to completely get me out of there, but... I'd have to put it right here. Which would still cover quite a bit. You know what? I'm going to get rid of the dung collector. We don't use... We don't use that much. I mean, I use it on... That's our only problem right now is I do use it on this field up here. Actually, have I even... We haven't even put any fields down for this guy yet. I forgot about that. Yep. Okay. Um, let's... Maybe we should try to get... Maybe we should try to get a increase of herbs before I do that. Yeah, that might be a good idea. Alright, we did tell him which way to go, right? Yeah, we did. Ooh, there's a mine over here. I see it. They were trying to hide it from me. Yeah, they it's, it, it, they put it just close enough that as soon as we're past the intersection, they're like, hey, there's some iron over here. But that's okay, because I can still reach it. I just need a team. You know, I must say, I was looking at the roadmap for this game the other day, and the next update, they want to bring in, like, flying traders, and I think that would be such a good idea, such a good addition to the game, because I'm sitting here looking at my resources, and I'm like, you know, I don't have, I mean, we have salt water, we have, you know, all this extra, all this extra stuff. That I'm not really using. Like we have a bunch of extra wood right now. Um, we have a bunch of extra wheat. We have flour. You know we have we have stockpiles of stuff. And I'm like you know being able to trade a little bit of that. And then purchase you know a couple of iron. That'd be so nice to have. It'd be so awesome. Yeah, get into the mountains. Oops, no, beets. Go back to the beets. Alright, well, at least we got a couple hundred corn out of our trip into the desert, so that's always a good thing. Food's up to 1,500-something. That's great. We're still at 155 on our stuff right there, so that's good. And I guess let's start sending people out and getting stone and stuff. I need some more iron mines. Oh, is that an iron mine? Oh, it's already scavenged. Never mind. Never mind. I got a little, little excited there. I thought I'd come across something special.
Hmm. I want to run across that, but at the same time, I feel like he's going to get tired and fall asleep right there if I tell him to run this instant. Yep, send him out. Keep going. Anbu, where's your food at? You were at 55. That's probably close enough to feed you. Oops. That's not what I meant to do, but that's what we're doing. We're feeding them with the small ones for right now. Come on. Throw it in there. Pop it in his mouth before we get to the thing. He has to eat before we run. No, dude, walk. Uh, petrified footprints. Investigate the tracks. 15 stones, 7 knowledge. Yeah, don't, don't eat. Don't eat that. We'll feed you. Uh, -uh. I will feed you. Keep going. You're just not going to stop, are you? Dude, go. Why can we not feed him? What is... On boo. Just, can you run? Yeah, get away from the tasty looking rocks. They're no good for you, dude. Oh, I s Yo, no, Ambu doesn't eat. Ambu walks. The food's behind you. Quit trying to eat it. Now can I feed him? Oh, I tell you what, that was so ridiculous. The fact that it denied us trying to feed him because he was over a feed spot. That's... Alright, dude. I need you to run pass this stuff for me. Alright. No, there's a mine. I just saw it. Get the mine. Uh, go north. Oh, you can probably walk now. Alright, where are we at? We're finally starting to get some some herbs. Let's, I guess let's send them out for some more people. So I'd like to try to get up to 200 people is what I'm aiming for. I think that's a safe number to get to. Yeah, I'm thinking a 200 population. I'd like to get it all the way maxed out, but I think, like I said, I think unless I move... Unless we remove the uh, the thing, the uh, the dung collector, I don't think we're really going to get a whole lot of a whole lot of stuff going on here. I think it's going to be almost instant, to be honest with you. I think as soon as it's removed, it's just going to be like boom, there it is. Max max production, if you will. And we got some people. How many people did we pick up? We picked up four people. 
Okay, so we are up to 182. That's not bad. That is not bad. I guess I can send one out here to this since it's the only one sitting there. Might as well. Anbu's still sleeping. It'll take them a minute to get out and go do their thing. So, who knows? Maybe there's a hidden achievement to get like a 100 extra science or knowledge points or whatever. Who knows? I know there's still a couple of hidden achievements I haven't achieved yet, and I don't know what they are. Collect those stones for me. Alright, we didn't have too many too many get poisoned this time. I'm actually thinking there might be a correlation between Abu's poison level and how fast my guys get poisoned. It's kind of what I'm thinking, because it seems like if I keep his level low, it drops quite fast. But at the same time, it only seems like they get affected when he lays down, so I'm still, still a bit confused on that one. So, but... I think we just asked that yesterday, and I don't believe we've had time to uh, see any responses yet. Any more iron mines anywhere? Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. I am not seeing anything. Alright, well this time we're going to see what happens with our kelp. I've got that farm turned off. I'm going to go ahead and add in... Oh, wait. This guy is... Turn that guy back on. So we've got both of our fisheries going. I could put in a third one. I'd have to put it in up here, though. You know what? Go ahead and put in the third one. Put it in up there. Make sure we don't run out of, of fish and stuff. Or kelp, I should say. Yeah. Swore patch. And, of course, poisoned island. We'll see how Ambu handles this. Yeah, it's a little hot for beets, but they still grow, technically. Or would it be better to run corn? Eh, corn's in yellow. Well, we have a lot of beets. Yeah, let's switch over to corn, since we're in, in the... in the ocean. Maybe they'll grow a little bit better. That's what I need right there. Got a mine. Actually, hold on. I thought beets grew better in the... Beets do grow better. Wait, what? Hold on. Oh, we were in... Never mind. Never mind. I thought something wasn't right here. Nope. Switch back. Switch back. It was because we were in the uh, that that heat wave. Sorry, I was like, I could have swore we just discussed this like a week ago, and yeah, and I was like, no, something's not right. Yeah, it's that's my bad. 
That is my bad. I bet you that's what I was thinking that last time we had this conversation and I checked it. I bet you I was in one of these hot spots. I almost guarantee that's what happened. All right, well, we're at 182 people. Everything's looking pretty good, I think, for right now. Lots of food, lots of stuff. Did we ever... Hold on, where did that... We Yeah, we need to add in another berry gatherer to that. There we go. All right, Ambu. I don't know what to tell you here. You're at 45% sleepy. Can we just push past? No, we can't push past because he's going to lay down right in the middle of it. Okay, well, the only thing we can do is let him let him take care of himself for a minute. As soon as he's rested enough, I'll try to get him up. That's the, that's the drawback to the ocean. You know, I haven't seen a single feeding spot in the ocean that hasn't had a poison cloud on it. I wonder if that even exists. Yep, back up to 30-some people. Alright, Ambu, you're down to like 30% sleepy. Can you go? I'm not even telling you to run. Let's just walk through it. killing me on my on my uh, herb supplies here I want to I want to drop I want to drop the dung collector yeah either one of those have a sleepy spot on them so let's just push past Okay, we are up to 60 kelp. That's great. That is great. Oh, well, you know what? That's fine. Get some more fish, too. That, that's completely fine with me. You run fish. You run kelp. I might just get rid of that farm altogether. Or we might turn it into a fish farm. Who knows? It doesn't seem like turning it into a kelp farm does us anything, though. I'm thinking we're going to go north. Yep, I would like to go north. Alright, somebody throw Ambu a snack. We've got some nomads. We've got a couple shipwrecks. Oh, there's a... Did we... Oh, we've already scavenged that. Sorry. I always see it right when we're leaving the area. And I'm like, ew. And there's a mine right there. i just seen it pop in. Oh, well. That's okay. Ambu's going to get up here and lay down and rest. So these two, these two boats, these two shipwrecks should go pretty quick. Let me guess. Strong thunderstorm? Strong thunderstorm. Not a surprise. Not a surprise. That's okay. We gotta have our hazards. If we don't, the game wouldn't be any fun.
Okay. Grab grab some more knowledge while we're sitting here. Why not? What are we up to now? 81. Yeah, I'm going to try to see if we can't get over 100 knowledge just just because I think that's going to be my in-game goal. 100 knowledge, 200 people, and I'm going to try to max out the uh the de the the bonus here. I'm going to try to see if we can't get it at a population of 200. So, that that's going to be what I'm shooting for. I know there's an achievement for getting like 500 population, but I think at that point it's going to be a lot of uh, huts. Not not a. I don't know if you can do it with cottages. I don't know if there's enough room on Anbu's back for that. All right, so you're moving again. All right, guys. Well, I think we're going to go ahead and leave off right here. So, like I said, those are going to be my goals. 200 population, max productivity, and then we're going to try to see if we can't get 100 extra knowledge just to have on hand, just to, just as a, a goal before I decide to finish finish this route. Um, we've already went how far with Anbu? 3,825 kilometers. That is like a huge, huge, huge distance. So, all right, guys. Well, that's going to be it for today's video. I do hope everyone has enjoyed it. If you have, be sure to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, do me a favor. Hit that subscribe button. It is an awesome way for you to show your support to me, to the channel, to the video, and to the game itself. And as always, feel free to share the video on any social media you're using. And guys, I'd like to stop, take a moment, and thank each and every one of y'all for all of your wonderful, awesome support. All the comments, all the likes, all the subscribers, and all the videos shared. It is awesome. I do appreciate it. And with that being said, until next time, survivors, keep on surviving.